Hey everybody, the Bong is back. Welcome to part 4 of Let's Play Classic Mario World 3 The Finale. Brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, we're in World 2, so let's do Thunderstorm Beach, which hopefully has no rapists. I guess they can have one. And even that's very disturbing. The water here is electrified because the storm avoids swim in clear waters, but for other way, the dark water is safe. <sighs> why do I try? Also, why the hell would I even want to go up here any further with all this? Oh! They got the Yoshi going up here! Can't believe they got the music very exact to Donkey Kong Country 3 standards. Oh! The water turns yellow. Beware, the storm is causing thunderbolts fall from the sky in this part of beach. Avoid the electricity here. I do find it annoying. They can't spell electricity. But I mean, it is a tough word. Don't get me wrong. But after a while, I mean, just, I don't know. Look it up. There's plenty of resources online out there. Oh, there's this. Okay. Well, the lightning doesn't fall as much, so I don't have to worry about it. I mean, this is based on an actual stage in Donkey Kong Country 3, Lightning Lookout, I think it was called, that had lots of lightning you had to deal with. Yeah, I should go grab that. Okay, those Sumo Koopas are gonna be annoying, but as long as I just keep on top of them, I should be fine. Well, not topping them to the point that I'm jumping on them, I don't want to do that, unless I'm spin jumping. I'm okay with that, because then I won't get hurt. You know, logically speaking, I could still get hurt, you know, by something else. The lightning air is actually very easy to dodge. So I don't think I have anything to worry about. Actually, I thought there'd be something up here, but there isn't. What's the point of that, then? It looks like a giant... Eleven? I don't know why. If I wanted to look at something that's giant and eleven, I'd go to my hundred, my six hundred pound life. I almost botched the name of the show, by the way, and for some reason, I'm addicted to that show. Maybe I already told this story, but I don't know why, but I enjoy watching these stories about people, you know, struggling and hopefully succeeding. I mean, I don't want them to just struggle forever. That'd be bad. The point is, like, if you're, like, 600 pounds, and then you're down to, like, I don't know, 450, and the doctor says, oh, you're not trying hard enough, like, dude, look how much he lost. Like, I could have just been back where I started, you know. So get off my back. Even though there's lots of room. Like, seriously. Just saying. Working hard. I mean, granted, I mean, there's still lots of lifestyle changes you gotta make, but I mean, you're getting there. That itself is an accomplishment. Just keep working harder. But at some point, I mean, you don't want to work yourself too hard. I mean, you'd eventually die. Why are there a bunch of blocks up there? Unless I can get up there somehow. Maybe I should try flying. If I can... Will I be allowed to fly like this? Yes, I can. Oh, I did that for the Yoshi. Oh, I could have got up there this way. Don't know why I went through all that stupid trouble. <laughs> but I guess that shows that's how you get the Yoshi here. Even though I did the uh, ridiculous way. <laughs> the unnecessary way. <laughs> there we go. Water Fortress. It was nice knowing you, Yoshi, but I think you gotta go. I know, I hate it too. Did I still not get the yellow switch? Well, you need to climb here. You know how to climb nets. Just press up while on one to hang and jump to leave. From now on, when I play these types of games, that's how I'm gonna be reading the dialogue. Exactly like that. If you don't like it, I mean, you can learn to deal. That's just how I roll. And I'm not doing this to be mean, I'm just doing this to be me. 
I'd rather be me than mean, okay? Uh, maybe I should, uh, take my time. Alright, so... I feel like I should have been able to get the yellow switch somewhere. Maybe if I try, you know, coming back to that stage. That secret exit I could not get. With a tail. Oh, I gotta hold on to this tail, of course. I imagine that's easier said than done. So, let's just do that. Just to be on the safe side to make sure that I keep it. You know, why don't I just have two tails? You know, just like that dude on Sonic. <laughs> not, not on Sonic, I mean, get away fanfiction people. I don't mean like that. I mean, I'm talking about like in the Sonic series, tails. I did not want to do that by the way, but oh well. I could just go to like a bonus house to get another tail if I wanted to. What I mean to say is that, you know, I like Tails, but I thought it was pretty cool. But my favorite Sonic character overall, uh, I don't know, actually. Maybe it is Tails. Knuckles is alright, but I hated playing as him in, like, uh, Sonic 2. Because even though he could glide, his jump was so low. It made the final boss in, uh, Sonic 2 nearly impossible to beat. That was a bad decision trying to let's play uh, Sonic 2 as Knuckles. Like, you know, Knuckles in Sonic 2. That was a bad plan. Made me a bit salty. And those were like long ago years, like when I actually let's play Sonic games. I mean, you had to look back to like, what, close to seven years ago? Jeez. Seven years ago that I practically did all the good titles that, if I did them now, would be well received. Like, I did all the good stuff early when I had, like, still shitty equipment. And now, I'm, I've got some decent equipment, and most of the good projects are already done. Well, I mean, there's still stuff on the GameCube, the Wii, the N64, the PlayStation, PS2. I say PlayStation, and even though I don't have a PS1, my PS2 does play PS PS1 games. I almost said PS1 games. I'm like, what? Where's the other coin, anyway? Wait, did I miss the coin? Did I really miss it? Oh, man, did I actually miss the coin? That's terrible. I could not think of anywhere else where it could be. It would be so hilarious if the coin was actually, you know, where the boss is. What if the coin is there? I just want to see if I can actually go back in there. You can't. Okay. Maybe I should just do the boss and just think about, like, you know, maybe go back to the episode and see, like, Oh, the coin was right over there and I missed it, because I'm an idiot. I'll just check everywhere again, I suppose. Who knows, I might have missed something very obvious. Or maybe I didn't, who knows. I would have noticed it for sure. Ah, that I don't have the fifth coin. I was pretty sure I would have known where it was. But I'm clueless into the matter at hand. No, it's not in there. It wouldn't be concealed by these blocks. Or maybe it would, I don't know. Oh well, I guess I'm not gonna find it. At least not right now. Have you noticed about the arrow signs around the levels? Well, they don't show only the way. They show some pipes hidden in the levels. The arrow signs around the levels? Well, they don't show only the way. They show some pipes hidden in the levels. Okay. I don't know what that means, but I guess we'll find out. That would have been so hilarious if the coin was actually up here. Well, I guess I missed something. 
Ah, Claw Grip, what's up? Now, I know in Mario 2 they call him Claw Grip, but that was English, okay? At least it's easy to fight him here. Ah, oh, that was weird. That almost kicked me off the screen. <laughs> Pipeline Ocean, okay. I think I will go back to that previous level. So, let's find out where that coin, I mean, that secret exit could be. I feel like I should have been able to get it. Maybe I can. Maybe all I needed was a tail. Let's go back to the grassy caverns. So, I think I spent most of the time flying. See what I can find. Oh, dear God, if I actually lost my uh, tail right away, that would have been so bad. Hmm. Let's try to fly up here. Nothing. Okay. I did remember seeing like a bunch of uh, blocks that I could not jump on while I was in here. So I guess it must be in like those uh, signposts over there that had arrows on them. Possibly. Let me take the P-Switch with me, just because. Don't know how it would serve me, but I'll take it anyway. Where was that block to? Like, was it around here? No? Okay. Let's fly, dude. Let's see where we're gonna end up. Guess I gotta keep going. Oh! Good thing I got another one of those. <laughs> Uh, I don't think I really need that, uh, bar flower. I'll just get one elsewhere. Is it up here? That's a Yoshi. Whole bunch of one-ups. Huh. Turns out the secret exit was elsewhere. Here I was thinking it was right there the whole time. It. Did I ignore it on purpose or something? Man, like, how the hell did I miss that? I'll have to go through this entire level again just to look. Hey, no, come back. <laughs> You're still needed. Was it down here? Oh my god. I could have found that secret exit a hell of a lot sooner. All along, I completely overlooked it, and here it was, in Dragon Fruit Woods. Oh my lord. So apparently we are like several episodes too late in finding the secret exit that leads to the Switch Palace. Uh, better late than never, I suppose. I'll definitely have to look back in the previous episode to see where I missed that coin. Well, at least I'm not gonna miss this one. Oh, that's gonna cost me some, uh, coinage. Yeah, I'll just grab whatever I could. Uh-oh, I almost missed it there. Um, why can I look back to that previous fortress? Like, I'm pretty sure I did not miss a coin. Like, I thought I found them all. No, no, oh, lost my power up and my Yoshi. Almost lost my life there. 
Having the worst of all worlds. Oh, there's another one. Crisis averted. Beautiful. Huh. Okay, let's see. Maybe there's a power up right here. There better be. There isn't. Hey! What was that? What was making that uh, egg hatching sound? Didn't you hear that noise too? Like, da -da -da -da? or whatever it was? That doesn't matter. You remember that glitch that if you like ate the wiggler like really fast and then just run right into it, you can actually die instantly, even if you got power-ups? Yeah, that was some weird shit, am I right? Oh, that one up is trapped forever. Unless. Aha! There we go, I cheesed it. I cheesed it good! How you like me now? Okay, watch where the last coin could be. I don't want to miss another one. Aha! That's how it's done. Okay, the one-ups are getting a little ridiculous now. Yeah, three-up moon I'm not gonna get because I left that, uh, server piece which activated a long time ago. Okay, that's a little over the top giving me all this stuff. <laughs> But I appreciate the effort in keeping me happy. Yay! Finally, we got that yellow switch pressed. So now we can actually just continue on with the game as normal. Man, like, how the hell did I miss that one coin? I'll probably have to go back to it at some point. You know what? Frig it, let's do it right now. Because the thing is, I, all I need to do is just get the coin and then I am then I don't have to do the level again. So I gotta scour this level from top to bottom and find out what the hell did I miss. I think having the yellow switch activated might help me in that. Because I am greatly troubled by the fact I missed something as simple as that. Oh yeah, this is so much easier having this. Um, where is the coin? Where is the coin? Where is that coin? Oi, oi, I don't know what I'm doing there. I'm not a, a musician. It's terrible. <laughs> you don't want to listen to my stuff. <laughs> I mean, seriously, like, imagine if I did finance my own rap album. It would just be so terrible. In fact, it would be so successful in spite of it being so terrible. Oh my god. I, no, no, I think I already got that coin. I'm pretty sure I was already there. Was it here? Because I don't remember this area. Oh, yeah, yes, I do. Never mind. I remember it all too well. <laughs> um, what if this was a glitch or something and then you only put four coins in here? That could be very possible. I feel like I looked everywhere and can only find three coins. Where's the uh, other coin? Where is it? Not here. Oh, come on. Don't do this to me now. Oh, wait a minute. This coin is probably the one I grabbed before. So there was really like two coins in that same type of area? Oh my god, we found it. We actually found it. There we go. We did it. Congratulations. Merry Christmas. So yeah, at least we didn't actually have to finish the level. Pipeline Ocean. Let's go. Yeah, some more Donkey Kong Country music. Romax tend to be obsessed with that type of genre of music. 
I find that there's always different renditions of Sticker Brush Symphony. I don't know why. I mean, it's a great track, don't get me wrong, but I feel like they're obsessed with trying to, like, uh, remake that one. As good as a song as it is. Okay, this one could actually be very annoying because of all the, uh, riptides or the, the jet streams. else here that's of importance well other than that coin oh my god if I had missed both those fish I'd have been so pissed like come on there was that little space like how could you sur they both survive but apparently they could have they just didn't all right let, let's you know let's take a hit go in here is there anything of value for me you gotta be kidding me I lost a power-up just to get like a one-up that I will not find necessary I think that's just abuse <sighs> okay whatever I'll, I'll deal with it waste of my time Guess we'll just continue on the rest of the stage then. Preferably, I don't have to deal with that kind of crap again. Oh, that pipe I can go in. Oh, that's what the uh, cracking of the egg sound effect is. It's really just the Hammer Brothers doing that. Yay! That was well worth it. That's right. Well, I guess that's what the... Yeah, the arrows do lead to uh, hidden pipes. Now I see what that sign was all about. I thought it was leading to, like, something else even more crucial. Like, more secrets. I did not mean to throw that right, but... You know what? Whatever. If it means something died, I'm happy. You know, like, digital, not real. I don't want anyone real to die, even though it's inevitable. It just mean a lot to some people, you know? You don't want to wish for people to die. That's cruel. Unless you're the one doing the killing. Then by all means, it's your business, as illegal as it may sound. I'm just gonna move on and do my own thing, you know? Preferably hoping nobody dies. You know, by, you know, brutal means. Natural means, you know, I'm all for it because, you know, you gotta keep it natural. The Grim Reaper is gonna be pissed if you had to wait so long. He's got a nasty scythe, I'm just saying. You don't know what he's like when he's mad because you hardly ever see his face. It's like he got a big secret or something. Does he have acne? I wonder. Probably get another Yoshi coin in here. So, I'm for it. Nope, just a one-up. Hardly worth it. <laughs> now I gotta find where that fifth coin is. Alright, stay in the middle. It's like a sobriety test. Wow. That extra life was dickish. Why would you put that there? Everything was just fine when I could have just gone on and did my own thing, but no. Oh. That was actually pretty tricky. You had one chance to get that. Oh shit, I'm, I'm low on time. Not just in the video, but in the actual stage. We need to go now. How big is this level anyway? It looks like it's still going. Does this music sound better when it's sped up? I feel like it has a little bit of a vibe to it. I mean, you gotta give it a chance sometimes. Oh god, we haven't stopped yet. Oh, there it is, there it is. Oh, thank god. I'm walking on nothing, what the hell? Thank you. Oh wow, level the secret exit, that's actually pretty... Not so common anymore. 
Fish Food Beach is the next level, and that will be in the next episode. Goodbye, everyone.